Life is like toilet paper. You're either on a roll or taking shit from some asshole. Excuse the background noise. It's car audio, car audio. It's Rebel Life Boxing. What's good? So, um, it looks like Ryan Garcia, he had took to social media the other day. He was talking about he saw Shakur out and, you know, he wanted to talk to Shakur, I guess, about making a fight or, or whatever it was. And Shakur was acting arrogant, stuck up, and all this other stuff. So he said, you know, recently now, you know, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fight Shakur Stevenson. I'm going to send him an offer. So apparently he sent Shakur an offer, I think, 1.5. You know, it'd be a little more than that. Because Tiafimo Lopez was offered to fight to fight Ryan next year, but he turned it down. And Tio said that ain't enough, bro. A lot of people's bashing Tio for that, but come on, bro, be real. Ryan Garcia is a big name, he's a household name. 1.5 million to fight Ryan. Tio is a fucking two divisional champion. Come on, man. No. No, so I agree. Fuck that. I agree. He, he would have got more than 1.5 because he would have got some back end money, but not enough, though, for somebody that is a current champ at 140. He was unified at 135 pounds. That's that's a disrespectful thing, bro. So I, I'm not mad at Tio Fimo for that. But far as Shakur Stevenson goes, Shakur says he accepts. He'll take that. And he said he gonna stand there and he gonna bang it out. So here's my thing though. Shakur said this before, like I'm gonna wash you, I'm gonna stand, and then he don't do it. But for some reason, maybe this time, he gonna have to bro, because this, that's, this is gonna be a redemption fight. So this whole thing with Shakur don't like to stand in front of power punchers and he looked really uh, subpar against De Los Santos was a gift and a curse, I guess, because Ryan Garcia wasn't hollering at him before that. That's the strange thing. Now, Ryan Garcia, I guess, think it's sweet. Like, yeah, I can run through him. I ain't got to worry about nothing. I'm going I'm to I'm fuck him up. I'm going to fix him. But you know what I think is going to end up happening in that fight? Shakur is probably working on some things. And I think Shakur going to wash this motherfucker. He going to wash Ryan Garcia. And he feel like now is this the fight where he gotta make it like make his think like I right, I'ma show you what time it is with me now. I don't like power punches or whatever, but watch me adapt to this shit now. Or you know, because he gotta he gotta show and prove this time. If he get in there against Ryan Garcia and do the exact same thing he did with De Los Santos, bro, I think the boxing public it's gonna lose all faith with Shakur Stevenson, bro. To be like to have star power, they're not gonna be as interested interested in watching fights anymore. It's gonna be sad, man. It's a sad. It's gonna be sad to watch. Uh, I think Shakur's career will definitely be affected by that, bro. So he's gonna have to bite down a little bit. Shakur, Ryan Garcia got a lot of holes in this game, bro. I, I don't know. If he brushed up, you know, whatever he learned from, from uh, Derek James, it's not going to be enough, bro. It's not going to be enough. I don't, actually, I don't think Ryan gets knocked out by those Shakur, but shit. But then when you think about it, that fight probably going to be a catchweight. I don't know if it's going to be a catchweight fight or if Ryan coming down to 135 again to fight for the belt, for the WBC belt. But luck, likely, it's, it's not going to be for the belt. Because Ryan said that he would drain when he fought Tank and all that stuff. So he's not going to fight at 135 unless it's, like I said, unless he really wants the belt from Shakur. I don't know. But I got I got Shakur piecing him up, bro. Piecing him up 12th round. I'm talking about unanimous, too. You know, Ryan is fast. He got the power. And he got the footwork, bro. He, he got the footwork. And he definitely don't know how to cut the ring off like that. So, Shakur is going to piece him up for 12 rounds, man. 
Don't be surprised if Shakur even give him a flash knockdown or something like that. I'll be surprised, you know, don't be surprised. But anyway, what y'all think about this Ryan Garcia offering Shakur Stevenson a fight, bro? Rebel like boxing. I'll catch y'all later. And I'm out.